We just want to say thank you for waiting for us for lunch. Uh, in fact, we at least got two minutes to eat. I hope that's okay. We're the chief medical officer. Uh, and then, within, uh, what, a half hour of eating, we're going to go out and do a wellness walk. And I want to really commend you for doing this wellness walk, okay? I just think this is a great idea as part of the program that we're going to go do that. Now, there's another reason why I think it's such a great idea, okay? Um, we're in a situation that we're flying today, and I, I'm very nervous. You know, I got my pedometer here, how I'm going to get to all my steps. I'm already at 5,255, and yet I'm spending the entire afternoon in meetings here uh, with all of you. So thank you for doing the wellness walk. I know I can get my number of steps up. We're just honored and pleased to be here to say thank you for your leadership on safety and wellness. Uh, this doesn't happen without your commitment and your dedication to both of these programs. It's very, very important to the state. It's important to your employers and, and most importantly to, to all of you. Uh, safety first, uh, the health of uh, our, our own lives in terms of the difference that all these programs can make. And we've just tried to make a real commitment at the state level to this culture of wellness. Uh, I'm very, very proud of the fact the state of Nebraska is the first and still the only state in America to, re to receive a C. Everett Coop Health Award for our commitment to health savings and, and uh, health improvements. Uh, we received that last year. We're very, very proud of the fact that, that you know, our claims are down by $4 million because our state workforce is healthier. You're undoubtedly seeing that in the organizations that we recognize here today. We've worked with the business community to develop the Governor's Wellness Awards. We're going to recognize a number of organizations today, business, education, government. But again, we're just mostly uh, here to say thank you. Thank you for your leadership. Thank you for your dedication. Thank you for your commitment. Every year over the last five or six years, we've seen both of these programs grow in importance. The number of people who are receiving uh, the awards, and again, ultimately, uh, greater safety, greater productivity. Uh, we're all making progress uh, relative to our health care costs. And again, I'm very proud to have the Chief Medical Officer uh, with me today. Uh, He's keeping really good uh, care of me. Uh, I can't imagine he's going to stand up here and say that normally you ought to consume your lunch in two minutes, so I'm anxious. <laughs> I'm real anxious to see how he's going to respond to this. Let me give you the Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Joe Cerno. Good afternoon. I don't know if it's a good idea to eat that quickly, but it does remind me of my years of residency. So uh, I think. Physicians and nurses might be the fastest eaters I've ever been around. I, my wife's a nurse, and I will tell you, it, it's, it's something to witness. But, you know, <laughs> she still loves me, let say that. But she's at home awesome, she's not hearing this. So anyway, uh, thanks for having us today. And I'm also glad to be here to recognize the, the businesses receiving the Governor's Wellness Awards. I want to thank the Governor, especially for being a champion of wellness. He walks the talk and sets a strong example for all Nebraskans. He's a driving force in promoting a culture of wellness across the state and helping people live healthier lives. Helping people live safer and healthier lives is why we're here today. And providing a work environment that supports health gives employees a chance to learn more about the benefits of living a healthy lifestyle and improving their health behaviors. <coughs> wellness works on so many levels. It's good for employees and it's especially good for business then. Wellness can help control health care costs and keep a vibrant economy. And the Governor's Wellness Awards encourage employers to make wellness a part of everyday life, which helps keep employees healthy. I will tell you, I spoke to a national group of state health officers a couple weeks ago, and they asked us to talk about what was going on in Nebraska. And it was a real honor for me. It's an honor for all of you. People are watching what's going on in Nebraska. They find it really remarkable the dedication that this state has to worksite wellness. And they are especially impressed by the Governor's Wellness Awards, what we're doing with state employees. So we should be proud of this state. Uh, we are setting trends, and they're watching us and want to know why we are as successful as we are. And I tell them, because in this state, we work together. 
and that is one thing I have noticed uh, in the short time I've been in this position is talking with people throughout the country. We are really blessed in the fact we do work together in the state, and I thank God for it every day. But thank you for embracing wellness in the workplace. Your efforts are changing lives for the better. Have a great afternoon.